today's video we will tell you about heritage institute of technology kolkata we will check out the infrastructure available at the institute how is the placements there what kind of courses are available what is the fees there and how is the faculty as well we will also find out what do students have to say about their institute in their reviews on shiksha.com hit is a private college under the maulana abul kalam azad university of technology in 2022 nirf placed hit in the 201 250 rank band under the category of engineering colleges if we check out the reviews given by students on shiksha.com students are head over heels for hit's infrastructure and the facilities that it provides they told us that the campus is well maintained there is a huge library with over 60000 books along with the facility of a digital library there are around 5 different playgrounds for various sports activities a medical ward is also available for students the canteen is decent which offers a variety of food options the campus is wifi enabled if you are a boy then this might be a deal breaker for you as there is no hostel facility for boys and apart from girls only the first year students are provided with the hostel facility students have given a rating of 4.3 stars to hit's infrastructure The 2023 official placement report of HIT is not yet released but according to the reviews provided by students on shiksha.com the average salary package offered here was around rupees 6 lakh per annum for BTech CSE branch the highest salary package was 15 lakh per annum and the placement rate was around 70 to 75 percent Students have also told us that the placements here are decent. The placement cell is constantly trying to expand its reach and invite more companies. Internship opportunities are also being provided to the students, but they still feel that a lot has to be improved. With 35% engineering emerged as the top sector for the students at HIT, followed by the IT sector with 20% of the students opting jobs in field. Education and business development sectors each had a share of 9%, while the rest of 27% opted for jobs in other sectors. HIT's performance is underwhelming in the placements parameter if we take a look at its rating on shiksha.com. This college has only managed to get a rating of 3.7 stars from students in placements. HIT offers 21 specializations in its BTech course. The tuition fee for all these courses start from 2.95 lakh rupees and goes up to rupees 3.93 lakh. MTech is also available here with six specializations, the fees details of which are available on shiksha.com. Admission in the BTech course of HIT takes place through West Bengal JE exam. Now let's have a look at the West Bengal JEE cutoffs for its various BTEC streams. The second round closing WBJEE cutoff rank in 2021 was 3198 for the BTEC CSE branch. In 2022 it was 4387. For IT stream the cutoff rank was 3788 in 2021. In 2022 the rank closed at 5869. The same cutoff trend can be observed for the AI and machine learning and the data science streams as well. In 2021, the West Bengal JEE cutoffs for HIT's BTech courses were more competitive as compared to that of 2022s. Student told us in their reviews that the curriculum here is relevant and industry specific. The semester exams are also not that tough to pass. The majority of the faculty members are PhD holders and have graduated from reputed institutes. Some departments faced a shortage in the number of teachers resulting in a poor student to teacher ratio but this problem was solved by onboarding teachers in numbers apart from this a few students feel that there is no other issue related to faculty and curriculum in HIT and that's why they have given it a rating of 4 stars for value for money the institute has received a rating of 4.1 overall the institute stands out with a rating of 4.1 stars out of a total 5 So this was the review of Heritage Institute of Technology Kolkata. How did you find this review? Do share your thoughts in the comment section below and please like and share this video and also subscribe to our YouTube channel.